never going to go out and win a game with three points. Um, I feel like our defense is playing well, like they did all, all last year. We don't want to squander you know, some of their better performances. How much concern is there, Ted? I mean, we, we know you guys have had bad stretches, slow starts. This one feels a little bit different the way it looks. How concerned are you as a guy who knows what it can look like? I mean, not concerned as far as, you know, the overall macro version of the season. Obviously, we got to get it going. You know, we've had two games now where we've scored three points. That's unacceptable um, as far as our offensive standard. So we just got to come ready to go, stay steady. Um, you know, kudos to the Titans. They came out and played a, played a solid game all, all phases. Um, you know, they earned that one. Obviously, we gave, we gave them some stuff, but, um, you know, they played, a, they played a good game. What more can you guys do? Because it, it seems like you guys say you have good weeks of practice and there's some sort of disconnect to game day. So what more can you do when you're stuck in a place where you're not looking at the results? I don't know if you can point to one thing. I think it's everyone, you know, with their individual process to be good on game day. We have 17 chances to, you know, show who we are and that was stunk today. Um, but we have to come to practice. This is a long season. Um, we just got to come ready to work. I know that's pretty cliche, but what else can we do at this moment? You know, you lose 27-3 to a good team in the AFC, but... Um, you know, unacceptable all the way around as far as just, you know, every, everyone had one, and that's not going to be able, to, you know, to win games in this league. I ask you this. What was Zach's message to the team out We got to come out ready to go. And we find ourselves at one and three. Um, you know, long season ahead still, but, you know, we don't have many disregards left as far as, you know, we can't just say forget about that one. We need to come out and, and, and get Ws. I ask this as maybe – an explanation and not to tee up an excuse, but how limited do you think this offense when your quarterback is limited himself? I, I mean, I'm not going to go down that narrative at all. You know, we need to we need to play better at, at every position group. Starts with the offensive line. Though we did some decent things today, but you know, we're not going to sit back and say Joe's not 100, so we only put up three points. That's just not that's not how we're going to roll this year. So um, we need to find a way to make some plays. Um, thought protection was decent. Um, broke down a little bit at the end, but you know, if your quarterback is limited, I don't know to the extent of it is, but the O line needs to be perfect, and we were not today. Does what happened like the 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 first drive? Uh, I'll tell you what happened at the end of the first drive. But uh, you know, you guys were rolling, you guys were rolling, and then Joe called the timeout. And you know, I think we just got behind on the play clock. On a, we had a double double play called, um, and we tried to get a can out, but kind of just fell behind on the play clock and came, what, four yards short. Um, that would have been nice to get a touchdown. Obviously, that's what we need to do. We need to put a premium on getting the ball in the end zone because we haven't been able to find it very much yet. Um, but, you know, that was a solid drive. Culminated in a field goal, only points of the day. You know, didn't do much after that.